right, so last we left off, we need to go and talk to Pascal about A2. <clears throat> Faster if you just take a look at this recording. I see. Information about this A2 android is indeed contained within our archives. We all understand her to be rather dangerous. However, she's never visited our village in person. My apologies. That's all the information I have. I see. All right, thanks. Let's stay sharp and head back to the resistance camp. We should run a check on our consciousness data and resupply. Hey, what's up, Kev? Yeah, no, I was just, I was just excited to play some more. <clears throat> Pascal has a quest. Small project. Collect and bring back any information you find. Right door, old world. Yeah, I, know, I was just really excited to play today. Although, you want to see the fruits of my labors from yesterday? Max level, baby! <laughs> Max level, baby. Also, weapons. I have one more weapon, and I know exactly where it is. Also, weapons. Level four. Level four. 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 Maxed out all the weapons I have so far. Yes, I did get the trophy. Yes, so I've got all my, so I got all the quests. Um, yeah, cleared quest 87% means I did unlock the trophy. Yes, and um, <clears throat> the next big thing is going to be the archives. But it turns out that a lot of archives are going to be coming out like soon in this um, in this story patch and also in the uh, in the C playthrough. So, yeah. Yeah, I only need 80% for quests. I'm still going to do some more quests because some of them are just, they're just good and fun and have good lore. I did a lot of, uh, I did a lot of uh, random side quests yesterday to, um, mostly to get, if I did side quests yesterday, it was mostly to get things like pod programs or more weapons or other stuff. So yeah, I also got all the pod programs. Two of my pods are maxed out. One more needs work. Let me tell you what the worst thing was, honestly, was getting these pods to at least level two, because there's this material you need that it's literally just random if it ever spawns. So you just have to reload the map every single time and just run around and try to gather it. It's, it's the worst. It's honestly the worst. It's so random if it spawns. So I could go and it never happening. But I am now set up to have everything done before I finish the game. I am set up to having 100% before I finish the game. 
Well, at least mount farming has a pity system, right? You do en enough times and you'll get it. This doesn't. <clears throat> Anyways, onward. 9S, why did you ask Pascal about A2? Huh? It's not recommended to interface with machines without consulting command. Yeah, I know. I'm sorry. Though I suppose such intense curiosity can be admirable, in its own way. <laughs> Thanks, 2B. Still, machines are the enemy. Don't forget it. I love that conversation between them. Operator 210 to 9S. This is your regularly scheduled contact. Yeah, yeah. No problems here. Copy that. I also need to inform you that the commander offers her personal praise for your recent achievements. As a direct result, we are currently considering boosting production of your model. Really? I'm happy to hear it. Aww. I couldn't have done it without your support, Operator. <clears throat> You're always so cool under fire, not to mention beautiful and... Flattery is unnecessary. Operator 210, out. You really meant it, though. <laughs> oh, 9S. You're hopeless, man. Also, like, like, look, the pod programs got updated. So, like, look, when I shoot this one, and if I charge it, boom! It makes an explosion. Big explosions. For every 9S, don't they need a 2B corresponding? What do you mean? So cool. I love that. I love that ability. That's my favorite one now. Uh, there's nothing that says that you have, there's nothing that says that they have to do it, but that's just what ends up happening. But there's also a little bit of a twist that I'm not going to spoil for you. I'm going to let you see later. So, yeah. Because <clears throat> also remember, the model types are like. Oh, so remember, the number is their, is their um, is the is their appearance, and then the letter is like what they do. You know, like um, so like. 9S, the, the mod, like, um, it's, it's an S, like, it's an S chassis, and he's a scanner. That's what the S stands for. No, there's a twist? What do you think it is? I mean, I already know, so it's not like you're spoiling anything. That's correct. Ding ding, that is correct. She is not a battle model. <clears throat> she does use the number two uh, model, but she's not a battle model. Anyways, I also wanted to use uh, this stream as an opportunity to start one of my favorite, um, one of my favorite side quests in the game that I never did my first playthrough. <laughs> so I don't even I, I I know in general what happens, but I don't know in detail. So I'm going to uh, gonna start it right now. I can't remember why that's done though. Oh, I know why it's done. You'll see. Yeah. Oh, fuck. Hold on. Delete. Dump it. Finger. Or 
Hmm, that's a strange flower. Analysis. It is a plant known as a lunar tear. A lunar tear? <clears throat> huh? When did you get here? So this flower is called a lunar tear. Seeing that dredges up all kinds of memories. Some of them are a bit strange, honestly. Like the one where I'm being attacked by a giant boar over and over again? Or another, where I keep trying out new parts every time my body is damaged. Sounds rough. Something about this flower fills me with an emotion I don't really understand. It's like something's pushing down on my chest really hard. So, um, do you mind if I ask you a favor? If you find lunar tears growing anywhere else, would you let me know? I want to try and figure out what this feeling is all about. What do you say? Of course, Emil. Anything for you. Aw, thanks. If you find another lunar tear, just let me know on this frequency, all right? I'm counting on you. There he goes. I know, man. <laughs> there he goes. <laughs> Okay, I know I know offhand where two of them are at least because I've seen them while just wandering around. I know where two of them are just off the top of my head because I've run into them just throughout the game. Man, I love this game's map. I swear to God, I know I keep saying it, but this game's map has probably one of the best maps I've ever had. Oh, it's so good. It's so good. All right. Um, wait, what the fuck is this? Wait, hold on. What is this quest? Wait, what is that? Oh, zoom out. Oh, are all these the Lunar Tier locations? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. Okay, that's cool. Alright. Okay, like I said, I know where one I know where two of them are by heart. I mean, you see how recklessly he drives around um the city area, the city ruins, just going zoom zoom zoom. We have to like shoot at him to get his attention. I don't know why I'm picking up stuff anymore. I don't need to I don't need to farm for anything anymore. <laughs> I'm good. I'm good, man. Surprised he doesn't turn it he doesn't run into something. Well, he is the ultimate weapon, so he's like, you know. He can't be hurt, so it doesn't matter. Yeah, it is just it is just habit, honestly. Because this was the place I farmed. Because I had to get something called pure water, and I had to go through all these spots, like right there. I had to go through all these spots and hope that it was pure water, and if it wasn't, then I just had to reload the map and try again. Easily one of the worst things. Keep this, bitches. Yeah, I got some pod upgrades, as you can see. Shit's so good. <clears throat> Dude, the pods are way more than just extra attacking now. It's so good. 
Oh, here we go. Here's the first one. This is a lunar tier, right? We better let Emil know. Hey there, guys. What's up? We found a lunar tier. It's located at... Stay right there! I'm coming! Uh, okay. I hope he doesn't expect me to just stand here all day. Sorry to keep you! Oh, hey. Now that I think about it, this whole area was once... Are you remembering something? It's all pretty fuzzy, but I seem to have a memory of caring for this flower a long time ago. But the sand kept expanding, and the flowers gradually wilted. Now that I think about it, that was around the same time I stopped seeing people. You mean humans? Thanks a bunch for finding this. Really. Oh, and let me know if you find any more, okay? I'm gonna... Stay here for a bit. Hmm. Emil. Pay him the fast travel. <laughs> yeah, no shit. Second one I know is at the amusement park ruins. The rest I'm gonna have to use the map to help me out. Cause I don't remember where they are. It's a lunar tear. I'd better tell Emil. Hey there! What's going on? I found one of those flowers you were looking for. It's over at- Don't move an inch! I'm coming! Don't move? I'm actually kind of busy. Sorry to keep you! Damn, you're fast! Uh, that's it. I remember now. Back when the aliens first invaded. Fought as hard as I could to save Earth. You did? I think I had something I wanted to protect. Something really precious to me. But I don't know what it was. Thank you for finding this. You'll let me know if you find any more, right? I'm gonna stay here for a bit. Precious Emil. Okay, where are the rest? Wrong button. Mm -hmm. Okay, so this one, the forest zone. Okay, that shouldn't be too hard to find.
<laughs> I have a feeling it's not going to be as straightforward. I was doing this earlier for something else. I think I can do it here, too. <coughs> well, maybe. surface then either. I know I must be able to get up there. It's probably up there. I guarantee you it is. Travel along the side here. Uh, yeah, this looks like this looks like this might be the winner.
thought, bitch. You thought. Woo -hoo -hoo. <laughs> you see that shit? Oh my god, that was pretty. That was pretty good. I that that, that was pretty good. <laughs> that that that. Mm, mm. I yeah, that was nice. Okay, well. There's gotta be something I'm missing, right? <laughs> man, fucking RPGs, man, and they're just in this bullshit. <laughs> well, I mean, to be fair, the first two were pretty easy to find. I shouldn't expect all of them to be that easy. But it also came from the fact that I, uh, I'd already found them while just venturing around doing the game. Ain't no way it's not up here. Like, this is the perfect place to have something like that. level and I missed it, I'm gonna be so mad. Son of a cunt. Is it? No, it's not. Okay. Oh, shit! There's a thing under here. Okay. They win. They got me. It's a lunar tear. I'd better tell Emil. I found a lunar. I'm on my way. Sorry to keep you. Oh my God. As speedy as always, I see. Oh. Oh. That's right. What happened here, Emil? I was fighting the aliens. It wasn't going well. So I decided to create multiple versions of myself to help with the fight. But the aliens just kept coming. I lost so many friends that day. It was a long time ago, but still. Say, Emil, how old are you anyway? I'm not sure. I didn't need that memory to fight. Thank you for finding this. Oh my God. You'll let me know if you find any more, right? I'm gonna stay here for a bit. 
That's such a sad line. I didn't need that memory to fight. A meal. Pork Navy. Not as much as he discarded, it's just that he spread he he created so many copies of himself that he spread his memory so thin. That I guess yeah, I guess whatever he didn't need, he um just kind of didn't think about trying to, I it's I think it's more that he didn't think about trying Oh, sorry, my headphones cut off a little bit. I think it's more he didn't think about trying to retain it, if you will. Not that he discarded it. Does that make sense? <clears throat> I don't know. I'm, that's what this quest is for. I remember, I haven't done the, I didn't do this quest in my first playthrough. I know that it exists. And I've been keeping myself in the dark about this detail, at least. Okay, where's the next one? Let's see, map. Desert camp. Hmm. I don't like this. I don't like going to the desert area. I get lost really easily. like it I didn't see any more on the map I knew it! I fucking knew it! <sighs> okay. I knew it as soon as I saw it. I was like, huh, that's a very sus location. God damn it. Okay. I don't remember how this goes, but I remember one thing. Hopefully I can carry that over. God fucking damn it. Man.
I get a feeling this underground passage has something to do with it. Also a dead end. God damn it. It's not as dead of an end. Oh no, this ain't gonna work. I don't think it is. Nope. Nope. Fuck. God damn it. Nope, I can't traverse that area. Shit. another entrance in here? I think this is another entrance. <laughs> oh, nope. This is just a dead end. I hate the desert area. now. Fuck. Ooh, well. Man, this desert area is like the fucking cathedral in Code Vein. I hate it so much. Well, at the same time, it's a very fascinating map. It's a very good map. Like, it's really incredible what they were able to do with it. It's got so much depth to it. But man, is it annoying when they put things in weird spots. desert area like 
secret area that I can think of. But I don't necessarily know how it relates to this, so... Damn, I'm going to have to look this up, because I have zero idea, and I definitely don't want to spend all time trying to figure this out. So I'm going to look it up really quick. Okie dokie. Alright, here we go. Desert area. Wait, no way it's that simple. Oh my god, I hate everything. Okay. Oh, this is embarrassing. I hate this. <laughs>
There it is. There you are. I should probably tell Emil about this lunar tea. Sorry to keep you. Oh my God! I didn't even contact you yet. Emil, are you okay? I just remembered. I. Hmm? Thank you again. You've helped me remember an important place. Oh? A place very special to him. And thanks, I'll tell you how to visit it. Please take this key. Elevator key? What's it for? It'll let you access the elevator in the shopping mall. You should head there whenever you have the time. I'm sorry. I need to stay here for a while. You go on ahead. Him. That has to be referring to Nier. Oh, hey! Look at that. Oh, another archive? Yo. Yes. Bro, you see how simple that was? I was going all around like a fucking moron. Oh, Jesus Christ. Oh, wait. Hey, you want to know you want to know a little trick I div I learned here? Watch this shit. Look, instead of going to the teleporter, I'm in range of the save zone. I just hit save. And then load. Yep. Pretty good. All right, so near the tower. Yes. Self-destruct on Blue Mage. I can't believe the size of the commercial facility. The people of the old world must have led pretty good lives. I bet it was fun to shop back when you had so many choices. We don't need such things. Don't be so sure about that. Once we eradicate the machine life forms, us soldiers won't have anything left to do. We'll enter a new age of peace. And when that happens, we should go shopping together. I could buy you, I don't know, a t-shirt maybe? Something that looks good on you. A t-shirt? What, not interested? Hmm, when that day comes, I'm all for it. That's a promise, right? Yep. Oh, that's so sweet. I love that. Yeah, I've been, I've wondered even in my first playthrough, like what the this fuck is this elevator for? This must be what key is for.
god. Wow. Look at all the lunar tears. Where are we? Thank you for coming. Emil, what is this place? It's the place from my memories that I work so hard to protect. Or, to be exact, the place protected by the person I used to be. Uh, sorry. I don't get it. A long time ago, I was created to be a weapon. A weapon that could adapt to any environment, and one capable of total destruction. You're... a weapon? When the war against the aliens started, I decided to strengthen that weapon by creating copies of myself. Interesting. So, in truth, I'm only one of a countless number of Emils. I, or we, I guess, worked with each other to keep our defensive lines intact. But the more of ourselves we created, the more our original memories began to fade. The original Emil liked this place a lot. He spent a lot of time here with people he loved. They were tough times, sad times, but the memories of that journey were his greatest treasure. And I have a few traces of those memories in my own mind. Where's the original Emil now? I don't know. There were so many of us that after a while, we just... Oh. And there's still something that all of us Emils need to settle. Hmm? Ah, <laughs> oh, right. I should probably repay you for all of your help. Please take this. It's said that a lunar tear can make any wish come true. Thank you. Oh, no. I'm the one who should be thanking you. You've helped me find some of my precious memories. Now I'll be able to keep pushing forward, even if I'm alone. Why'd they have to play this music with this? God, Emil. <sighs> I know, right? Oh my god. Oh, this is beautiful. I don't need these uh, materials anymore with all the grinding I did, but still. Oh, another archive. Project Gestalt Report number 10. Good.
can't reverse it. All to protect the world that his friends fought to. Say, all to protect the world, or to save a world his, fin his friends fought to protect. And he can't die. Heartbreaking as that was, that was good. Oh, are you fucking... Get out of here. Also, this sword is my favorite short sword in the game now. Like, I will not, I will not use a different one. Well, I might use a different one, but it, but I do love it a lot. The engine blade. Look at that. Yeah, you know that the engine blade is actually, uh, it's actually from another game. Can you guess what game? Or did I already tell you? Nope. It's not near Replicant. Nope. Hi, Emil. I can't help but always want to stop him. Hello. Oh, hey there. Did you need? Oh God, the costs for the chips for his are so expensive. It's better to make my own. The customer is always right at a meal super shop. <laughs> yeah. Hey, you know what? The physics was really the physics is pretty realistic.
But no, this is actually Noctis' sword from Final Fantasy XV. I've, I, believe it or not, I've already bought from Emil. I've already bought a lot from Emil. Like, um, he sold weapons that I needed. Like, yes, he sold weapons. And I didn't know this until later. Um, <clears throat> if you catch him in certain areas and you cycle through his, uh, his, um, his inventory, He'll actually sell, like, um, in-game materials. Things that you need to actually upgrade to the final steps of your weapons. So you know what I did? I stockpiled the shit out of those. Report. Mail notification received from access point. Don't trust me. I bought from Emil a lot. I just kind of wanted to say hi to him that time. And to see if he's still, you know, moseying around. Aw? Hey friend, thanks for stopping by. You into fishing at all? Holy sh shit. Aw. See, this is what I mean. This is why Emil's best boy. Yeah, you can visit him at home, yeah. Remember he says he lit remember he said that a while ago. He says, feel free to visit me. I live deep underground. Whatever the fuck that means. Skill is so good. wet with that black all that black and wet damn That other place um, converges onto here. Okay, got it. Damn, these guys here are level 50. Nice.
Oh, hello. Out of here, you piece of shit. Oh, did I kill it already? Hell yeah, brother. Okay, dead end. Cool. Ooh, machine core, yay. It's worth a lot of money. Yeah, apparently I had a shit ton of machine cores, so I sold all, I sold damn near all of them. Actually, I think I did sell all of them to uh, get enough money to buy all the um, upgrade items from a meal. It was great. Can't wait to upgrade that pod. He's gonna shoot more missiles. <coughs> wait, how far does this go? Oh! My lord. Look at all the dead bodies. These are like players. <coughs> oh no. Of the inscrutable life form known as Emil. It's Emil's house. We found it. All oh, the music. Listen. Wait, did I actually activate it by mistake? Oh, okay. Oopsies. That was creepy. Alert. Theft of physical objects. 
objects may disturb the resident. somewhere here. Or am I just fucking stuck? There's no way we could be stuck, right? Because... Maybe I can do that little trick. Yep, there it is. Okay, we're good. Ah, there we go. I wonder if this... There we go, I need to fix that positioning. Oh, hey, that's that elevator from earlier. Oh, so now we can go down really easily. Very nice. Cool. really quick.
getting close to the Oh. Report. Mail notification received from access point. What do we got here? Oh, the <laughs> Oh, this message. I remember this message from the last playthrough. Wait, what the fuck is under my Oh, Zidon. He's he's under he's yeah, I see you, baby. He's at my feet.
Oh shit, I was muted. No, yeah, I was gonna say that like, um, this is uh, stuff to upgrade your um, your weapons to like the last level. So I needed a, I wanted to get a lot of these so I didn't have to fucking go farm for them. So it's like, oh shit, yeah, I'll sell a lot of things to buy these things. And look, you had to also buy two weapons from him to get all the weapons. So. Oh boy, the world's really going to hell in a handbasket, isn't it? I actually had a bandit break into my place a little while ago. After that, I put all my valuables in a secure container. Now I don't have to worry anymore. So yeah, we can still use this elevator. Dope. Damn, he wasn't kidding. I need to up that security a little bit, though. cherished companion of mine, but you still must be punished! Oh god. Oh god!
HP is going down a lot. I can, I can beat him. Yeah. I lost. Oh. I guess power is the only thing that counts in this world anymore, huh? Well, go ahead and use this room for whatever you like. I don't mind. I'm sorry, Emil. There it is! There's the last weapon! Thank you, fellas. So fucking lost. Okay, yeah, I should go this way. Okay. Okay. That's the last weapon. Save point. <laughs> Get that last weapon upgraded for the trophy.
Damn. Yes! There it is! Ah! All weapons upgraded! see what these weapons are about yeah look at that 100% on weapons let's go let's go okay details oh my god swing these weapons to hear Emil's voice holy shit <laughs> Wow. Best boy, Emil. All right. Okay, I think we've done a lot. I think we've done most, if not all, the grindy stuff. <sighs> so let's go ahead and get to this. It's going to be like, um, like where 2B and 9S are going to be separated. This next quest incoming. Or at least these next coming quests, yeah. Oh, 2B. Your timing is impeccable. Our android forces currently have a carrier deployed in the Pacific Ocean. It should be back here to resupply before too long. The Resistance is assisting with the mission, so I'd like to ask you to run a little guard duty. Seriously? Dead serious. There's a stockpile of missiles down at the shoreline that needs to be loaded on the carrier. And with all the machine activity lately, we need to stay on our toes. Of course, if you're already working on something for Yorha, I don't mind if that takes priority. Anyway, thanks in advance.
God damn. Why must we read all these books, brother? Knowledge expands horizons and enriches existence. But can't we just transfer all this data over instantly? Into your head, perhaps, but not to your heart. <sighs> I guess. Hmm. Hey, so... Yes? My name? Eve? This book says it's a woman's name. Shouldn't we be called Cain and Abel or something instead? <laughs> Humans wouldn't change names so easily. Besides, you should be proud of the name Eve. Huh. Well, if that's what you think, then I'm fine with it. Glad to hear it. Um... Is there something else? After we're done reading, can we go out and play? I'm sure it'll be tons of fun. All right. But only after we're finished. You mean it? Then I'm gonna try extra hard to finish this. <laughs> extra, extra hard! You do that. Alright then. Bedrock here was bombed out in the last war. Looks like the whole city is starting to sink as a result. Target missile sighted. Is that what we need to protect? Let's take him out already so I can be home in time for dinner and a bath. Androids don't need to bathe. As long as you perform regular cleaning and maintenance, bathing is unnecessary. Yeah, but come on, 2B. It still feels good. I think that's the last of the machines. 2B, 9S, come in. Commander? Emergency orders incoming. The carrier ship that was set to resupply has come under attack. It's currently being engaged by a swarm of machines. I've asked all Yorha troops in the city ruins for assistance, and I'll need you to provide backup as well. I'm sending flight units and coordinates now. Good luck. You see? Total slave driver. Whoops. If she didn't order <laughs> others around, what kind of leader would she be? Hmm. If you say so.
laser whip. Holy shit! of a large-scale enemy inbound. Looks to be 2.8 clicks southwest of us. Enemy aerial unit destroyed. Reverting back to area reconna- Wait! I'm still picking up a large enemy presence. Didn't I kill that already? What on? If it's that big, we should be able to see it. Well, now we see it. There's well, the big boy. Not... Range attacks with the MP blasts. We've got to find another way to damage it. Operator 210 to 9S. Command has decided to stage a direct satellite laser strike on the hostel. We need you to destroy the enemy EMP generator so we can lock onto the target. EMP generator? Sending the coordinates to your map now. EMP generator target confirmed. Marking on map. Proposal. Destroy the generator quickly. Obtained from command. Go ahead. 
The only known record of this machine life form is a lone sighting 320 years ago. Upon reaching land, the unit unleashed a devastating electromagnetic wave attack. All resistance fighters in the vicinity were annihilated. So basically, if this thing reaches land, we're screwed. Affirmative. elimination of electromagnetic interference. Stand by for incoming satellite laser strike. Oh, come on! It's got an electromagnetic barrier over its whole body? Having trouble over there? Are you Yorha? Hunter Squadron deploying out of North 12C Defense HQ. I'm the commanding officer, 4B. Don't worry, we'll take it from here. To b let's leave this area to the reinforcements. I have an idea. You and I should meet up at the spot I just marked. We've got mortars lining the shoreline here. All the EMP shielding in the world won't help against close-range mortar fire. Got it. I'll help aim. <laughs> this thing's armor is too thick. We need more firepower. 2B, let's try for a more direct approach. Direct? Oh, right. That's right. Lay down some fire in its stupid mouth. Toopy, this is bad. Are you all right, Toopy? That enormous machine is an ancient weapon. It was designed to help annihilate the android. But it wound up going out of control. I was part of the machine's network when it happened. So I remember it. The moment it reached land, it went berserk and began attacking everything in sight. No one could figure out how to stop it. We eventually marooned it deep in the ocean. But it seems to be searching for a way back. Huh. Hey, 2B. I think I have another idea. You keep that thing right where it is, okay? What? Please, Tubi. This is gonna work. Tubi, I'm going to see if we can use those missiles back on the shore. 
But I need you to destroy the EMP unit on that big back. Otherwise, they're just going to go off course. Activate missile controls. Prepare to launch. Missile controls engaged. Launch ability confirmed. Fire! I didn't think this would be so hard to control. Alert. Obstacle ahead. A collision at this speed is not recommended. Well aware, thank you. Got him. S signal lost. Organize a search and rescue party for the missing Yorha members at once. To be nine S. Don't die on me. child held sway over enormous strength. But sadly, he was also a little bit broken. He spent his long days hurting those around him. He tried his best to be good and kind. But despite his efforts, things never seemed to turn out. They told him he was unwanted. They abandoned him in the deep, dark ocean. And from the cold at the bottom of the sea, he cried out, Mother! 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 But his voice never reached his mother. This is Tactical Support Unit, Pod 042, assigned to 2B. This is Tactical Support Unit, Pod 153, assigned to 9S. We pods often participate in the same battles. Exchanging our situational data would theoretically allow us to plan combat strategies in a more efficient manner. Proposal. Data should be transferred regularly between Pod 042 and Pod 153. Analysis. This idea is sound. Proposal accepted. Records will be organized in time for the next situational exchange.
Oh shit, I'm reading out loud and my mic was muted. My bad. I find myself in a bizarre memory storage area stretching as far as the eye can see. It's a maze, a labyrinth, a massive interconnected network. I've never seen anything like it. It must have been created by the machines. So then, what am I doing here? I am 9S. That's all I can remember. A large portion of my memory may have been destroyed. What if I forget everything? My memories, myself, my... Okay, calm down. Calm down, calm down, calm down. Just follow the emergency manual and execute the memory recovery pro program. The recovery program begins to fill in the blanks in my memory. They drift back like missing letters, filling out a word. The bunker, Tubi's plan, a colossal machine, life form. The last restore missile strike, or the last resort missile strike. Preservation mode was activated at the moment of the blast. It halted most of the safeties in the, net the network had in place. took a while, but the recovery program managed to restore most of my memory functions. However, I still can't establish a link to my body. Well, I guess there's nothing else to do but examine the surrounding memory space. Looks like the machines gathered and stored a lot of info in here. It all seems pretty random at first. But on a closer inspection, I learn how it's all connected. There are a variety of entries, such as data on human history and philosophy. But what's really strange are the records of machines stored next to those. And the politics category are records of the machines' own governmental endeavors. They tried all sorts of things. Absolute monarchies, republics, democracies. And that wasn't all. They also engaged in other scholarly pursuits, such as philosophy, mathematics, science, and social criticism. It's like the network was copying every possible human behavior and discipline. Almost as if are imitating humans? Why would they do that? Why indeed? dive deeper into the records. I can find no indication of the machines creating new cultures or values. They only imitate human behavior. The strange thing is, if a unit falls, if a unit fails, it fails the exact same way the next time. For example, if a machine forms a dictatorship that eventually collapses, it won't try a new type of government. It just forms a new dictatorship. Or if it plants crops and they die, 
it just tries the same thing again. And again. And again. And again. They keep performing the same behaviors. They don't ever learn. When it comes to combat, the machines show overwhelming adaptive behavior and evolutionary speed. So why do they insist on imitating humanity? And more specifically, why do they imitate their failures? It's almost as if the objective is failure itself. I sense a change in the data, some kind of movement. I hone my perception and hold my breath. I, I hear something, a distant voice. I am not. All androids, there's something there, something clearly intelligent. What the heck was that? Are they talking? Announce to all androids. The words shimmer into focus. The voice grows clear in my mind. It is Adam, a machine made in the image of man. We machine life forms have evolved, he says. We made war, learned, grew, and thus we gained a new consciousness. Indeed, it is as if a new form of existence has been born. Lies, nothing but lies from mere machines. Adam laughs. And yet you androids claim to be alive. How very odd. You are puppets who lack even your own free will. No, you're wrong. His words flow through me as if they were poured into my ear. How am I wrong, boy? I'm... We're... Perhaps you have a will after all, he chuckles. Perhaps you have desires. Now you see, boy, the true meaning of life is hatred. You're wrong. Vile hatred slumbers in the depths of your heart. You're wrong! The more you try to hide it, the more that darkness grows. Wrong, 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 wrong! made to protect mankind. We're not the same as you machines. All who live are slaves to desire. Such internal appetites are what give our lives meaning. Some seek beauty other's serenity. For me, hatred is the I'm not like that. <laughs> oh yes you are. You do not trust anything. You want to destroy everything. You have lost hope. Your 
thinking about how much you want to... Oh! You're thinking about how much you want to fuck 2B, aren't you? Reality stained by lies. Stop. Stop it. Hatred pouring into you. You're wrong, damn it. Overflowing desire. I'm... I'm not like you. Your true self. We're not the same. Stop it. Stop it. It's not my fault, okay? Damn it, I... Stop it, stop it, stop it, help! Help me. Each of the machines treated their treasures with great care. One treasured family above all else. Another treasured its older sibling. Another treasured its own beauty. But one more machine treasured something unique above all else. Hate. Is this... death? All right. Engage memory core diagnostics. Yeah, yeah. A single reply is sufficient for acknowledgement. Fine. Hi, Delta. Doing good, man. Memory core diagnostics complete. No issues detected. Good. Proposal Engage visual sensor diagnostics. You got it.
Visual sensor diagnostics complete. No issues detected. All checks complete. <sighs> Took long enough. Ain't that Don't how you it think be. it's overkill to perform a full data overhaul? Unit 9S was seized by the enemy and placed in a non-controlled state for an extended period of time. There is a high probability of corruption by an enemy logic virus. All right, all right, cram it. Anyway, I just gotta sync up with the bunker server and then I'm out of here, right? Yeah, 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 but it, like, I'm telling you, that's just how it is, regardless of if you're hunting for shinies or hunting for, like, max size Pokemon. Missing anything in here? Also, I don't know how much you know about this, um, but I did um, I did uh, Emil's memories side quest earlier, and it was so tragic. I never did that my first playthrough, so it was nice to see. But I'm also really close to platinuming the game. I just need a few more things to go through the story again, and then I should be golden. See, so yeah, I'm glad I didn't reset my file. Um, I'm glad I didn't reset my file and just played from my old one, because let me tell you, grinding those weapons, it's rough. You don't know much about Automata? Yo, dude. Dude, it's a, it's a lot of good stuff. If you ever want to just listen to me ramble, which I know it's probably like a tall order there. If you ever want to listen to me ramble about Nier's lore, I would love to share it with you because it's some good stuff. It's really, really good stuff. Huh? What was that? Unknown. Halt the data sync. Alert. Data synchronization is mandatory for all your high units. Yeah, I know that, but we just got some kind of weird noise. Halt the data sync for 2B as well. Affirmative. Let's figure out where that noise came from. Just to be sure, you know? Open a port to the server. No time to examine everything. Better stick to the main data nodes. Yeah, like, I'm going into this game with a lot more knowledge about the entire near lore than I did before. And it's, it's, it, it's literally like a whole new experience. So even though I've played it before, it feels like a new experience. So I'm really enjoying it, you know? Because, like, I'm fresh off of playing Near Replicant as well. What's the point of all this heavy security? All the black box data has been deleted, but it looks like everything else is here.
I know you're somewhat informed about, like, Drakengard stuff. Oh, good, because so did I <laughs> before I started this series. Before I started, like, wanting to stream the series, that's what I did, Detected. too. Access lock to Council of Humanity's Lunar Server. Because, like, nothing was a spoiler to me. But, like, um, it was good to kind of, like, get a lot of that stuff reinforced. So that way, when I went through the games, um for Replicant and Automata, because I'd played to Gestalt like, year, like years ago, but I don't remember any of it when I played Automata, so it was still like I didn't know anything. Now I'm play I went through Replicant and I'm going through Automata again. It's literally like a new experience. It's great. What's a barrier doing here? Hmm. Looks like records for supplies shipped to the moon. Strange. There were a ton of empty containers. That's weird. Why would they do that? Huh? A new port just opened. Ninus snooping around. Detected. Council of Humanity and Project Yorha Records Index. Alert. We are not authorized to access this data. Man, this stuff is all wrong. I need to check this out, too. An attack barrier? Really? Why the heck would they install one of those in this server? Ooh. Let's see. It looks like info about how the Council of Humanity was formed as part of Project Yorha. Wait, isn't that backwards? After a long period of battles and adventures, the prophet spoke. Oh, grant me the mercy of the land. Oh, grant me the joy of the heavens. Release me from my yoke of iron. Thus shall our souls be. Uh, what was that? Crap! Did they find me? Negative. Emergency backup request from 2B. Close the server connection and activate my body. Affirmative. Ah, 9S. Operator? What happened? We recently detected large numbers of machine life forms throughout the factory area. We received a support request from 2B soon thereafter, but have been unable to respond due to poor reception. All right, I'll try to gain access from the main terminal. second.
Use of server administration room requested. Request granted. You may now use the device in this room. Okay, good. 2B's black box signal is still up and running. These comms are all messed up. Guess I'll have to break into the other side and take control. Part. Nice. Now I just have to unlock the door where 2B is.
Better send these coordinates to the bunker, just in case. Thank you.
Dealing with that shit. Disabled. The door's open. Keep moving. All right. I'm obtaining the Gestalt reports, hell yeah!
right into that one. I'm racking up some archives here. System at 20% control. You have to hold out 42B. Factory system at 50% control. Now we just have to do something about this core. After a long period of battles and adventures, the Prophet spoke. Oh, grant me the mercy of the land. Oh, grant me the joy of the heavens. Release me from my yoke of iron. Thus shall our souls be saved. Forever and ever. Forever and ever. Those were the words I heard in the moon server, but why? Alert! 2B has defeated the Goliath-class heavy weapon unit. Hmm? Ah, uh, right. Okay, good. Nine S. Commander? I'm sorry. You're needed back at command. Understood.
You left quite a trail when you accessed the main server. That's what I wanted to speak with you about, Commander. <sighs> I found records stating that the Council of Humanity was established as part of Project Yorha, but I'd always heard it was the other way around. So did Yorha actually create the Council of Humanity? <sighs> yes. We installed the Council of Humanity's server on the surface of the moon. But that means... Mankind no longer exists. <sighs> There in truth, is. humans never went to the moon at all. Any transmissions received from the moon are just dummy signals we set up in advance. The only thing there is a small bit of data relating to the human genome. But why would you... Humans were already extinct when the aliens attacked. All the details are stored on this memory chip. If you want to look at it, I won't stop you. Wait. You're just giving me this? But why? No one fights without a reason. And we need a god worth dying for. What path will you take? It's up to you to decide. Why? Why did you have to die? It's not fair! My only brother... Damn them! I'll kill them! I swear I'll kill them all! The human race is... gone. How do I tell 2B? Emergency protocol, phone F2. All your commanders are to report to combat stations immediately. Repeat, emergency protocol, phone F2. All your commanders are to report to combat stations immediately. Combat stations? I better get a move on. Alert. Mission orders received. Rendezvous with and support Unit 2B near the resistance camp. Any details? Large numbers of machine life forms are rampaging through the city ruins. What? How? They're supposed to be weakened. Cause unknown. Goliath class enemies also confirmed. Immediate action advised. Contact from command. Alert status raised to level four. Repeat. Alert status raised to level four. All units current. What the fuck was that? I wasn't the only one. There was something there. To be, you okay? Alert. All communications are currently being jammed. We'd better hurry. nearby. She is likely engaged in combat. Oh! You okay? Good thing I landed that direct hit. Uh-oh. Kill 
die. All of you are going to die. <laughs> They're still... coming? What do we do? There's too many. Chilby? Chilby, can you hear me? Our village is under... Pascal? Come in, Pascal! Oh, shit! Locate Eve's current position. Location has been detected and placed on map. We'll take care of Eve. You just worry about keeping the village safe, okay? Do be careful. like he's bombarding the area with forced connections. I think all these transmissions are making the machines go haywire. We have to find Eve and destroy him. Oh, um, now what? Ah. Uh. And here you are. I know you two feel the same. That this world is utterly meaningless. As far as I'm concerned, my brother was everything. And now, everything must die! You kill my brother! I... I... Alert. Massive energy signature detected. What is it? 
The energy seems to be coming from a large number of latent machine life forms. He's absorbing the life force of whatever's left on the network. Damn it! We'll never get anywhere like this. I'm going to try hacking into Eve and shutting him down. Back me up, 2B! On it. Nothing else. What is this? Alert. Disruption detected in Yorha Unit 9S's subconsciousness data. Corruption potential critical. Evacuation recommended. I can't. Not when I'm this far in. Brother was everything to me. My life was contained in our moments. Alert. Corruption confirmed in your unit 9S's self-consciousness data. Immediate evacuation and treatment recommended. Just a little more. If I can remove Eve's object control function. Listen to me, Adam. I never disliked fighting, but I didn't want you to be hurt. And I especially didn't want to lose you. So let's go somewhere quiet. Together, my brother. over.
I'm alive. Transmissions. They're resonating with each other. data in the machine side of things. Next thing I knew, my sense of self was regenerated over the surrounding network. Having multiple selves fused together like this is a pretty valuable experience, so I wanted to record it. But I couldn't access any storage areas yet, so I just multiplexed it over the memories of some nearby enemies so that when I returned to my own body, I... Yes. I'm glad you're okay. Yeah. And so, 
the final battle with Adam and Eve came to an end. This battle will likely have a great effect on the outcome of the war. To B and I, our battle will continue for some time to come. But that's another story for another day. Yeah, on 9S's side of things, he was told by Commander the truth about humanity being extinct. Like at this point in the story, we as the audience find out for the find out if you don't have near info or don't or don't know about near lore, find out that humanity is extinct. And now we're going through like what? What now? waiting for you. I needed to give you this. Say, to be. Uh, no, never mind. Just be careful. Planning preparations complete. Confirm equipment delivered to quarters. Remember your pain, the pain of having your homeland stolen. We will never give up our struggle. We will take back the seas, the skies, the land. We will take back our world from the scourge of the machines. We will not fail in this mission. 
Here and now, we will put an end to this goddamn war! Glory to mankind! Glory to mankind! <laughs> this game is so good.